afternoon, everyone. This is Jared Rand. Welcome to the Global Guided Meditation Call for 3 p.m. Eastern, February 20th, 2019. We look at the current
So what happens is, is that we see despicability disintegrate. We see coerciveness, vileness, manipulation, deceit. It disintegrates. It cannot exist. We do not allow it to exist by being in those fields, by being those frequencies, those energies. See? So in this meditation, the power of creation, the power of intent. Now, understand that we can embrace the entire collective consciousness of all that there is, ever has been, ever will be. It is everywhere. That's how. That's why it's so silly for us to believe that we're alone. It's, it's just silly that we're alone. We're never alone. It's embracing that, see, but your ego and your physical body dictates otherwise. It, it, it pushes on you. It manipulates you into thinking that you're alone, you get depressed, you get frightened, you get scared, you get worried, you get anxiety, all these things. Now, I'll give you a real quick example. When you're in a group, for most of us, okay, not everybody, but the majority, when you're in a group, you feel more content. When you're coupled, you feel more at ease. Those people who are coupled live longer than those who are not. Reason is, is that as we combine the collective consciousness in love, and it doesn't need to be romantic love, just in love, it expands. You're plugging in, when you are in joy, peace, prosperity, and happiness, you're plugging into the entire collective consciousness. See? This is when you attract all that you desire. It is the only time that you will attract in such fluidity all that you desire. See? Now, obviously, if you are in hatred, anger, destruction, uh, uh, manipulation, greed, uh, selfishness, you will literally attract with fluidity all of that and anything attached to it into your existence, into your, your living. It is easier for humans to embrace the degradation, destruction, pain, sorrow, anguish, fear, uh, and worry, then it is love, compassion, understanding on a continual basis. You see what I mean? It, you have a split, yin-yang, a split. It is bringing balance. That's what Buddha did. That's what Petraeus did. That's what Lakshmi did. That's what uh, St. Germain did has done. This is how it's done. This is how you make the transition. You become more and more enlightened. You be you stay more in those fields and those frequencies and you emit them of love, peace, joy, happiness, abundance, prosperity. It's the only way that it, it, it it's the only way it can take place. It's the only way. Wishing and not participating has always been unsuccessful. So, I am the power of creation. I am the power of creation. If you'll go to the place... Uh, where you're not going to be disturbed, I'm sure most of you are. And as I talk, relax the body. Some of you may be feeling anxiety, stress, un un unusual amounts that, that in the last few days have come over you. Um, 
the energies are very high. They're going to increase. So you're, this is normal. It's normal uh, for this for you to be experiencing this. Some of you um, relax the body. Let all of this fade away, vaporize all of the worry, stress, fear, anxiety. Majority of us will have anxiety in different levels off and on throughout life. But now it's become more intense. So, you know, relax. Drop it off. Empty the pockets. Be light. Be in the now. In the now. In the moment. Remember through the heart mind. Be in love. Be in peace. Be in joy. Be in happiness. And as you do this, as you're relaxing, you're going to want to breathe. You want to breathe through the nose and out through the mouth. You breathe in through the nose. You hold it 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. Exhale through the mouth. While I'm talking, you want to do this at least six times. And as you're breathing in, you're breathing in divine positive energy. It, it is everywhere. It's all around you. And this is always an awakening as you breathe in, as you listen to your breathing, as you feel your breathing. You become clear. You become placid, tranquil. And this breath that you take in, this inhale of divine positive energy, transmits to you knowing that you are the power of creation, that you are part of the collective consciousness, that all you have to do is turn your key and the door springs open. This is letting you know that you are not standing in front of yourself. You are not blocking yourself from this understanding. You feel it. You enjoy it. You're happy with it. You're embracing it. It is fluid. You know this. You've always kind of known it, but now it's in front of you. It's very, very supportive and loving and reassuring to let you know that, hey, you are the power of creation. As you exhale, you're exhaling all of your doubts, all of your fears, all of the conflict with the ego and the mind, everything that would do its best to stop you from your understanding and clarity that you are the power of creation. Falls away. It, it vaporizes. Call in the purple transmuting flame literally transmuted into neutralized substance. It is gone. It will, the, the purple transmuting flame will take it, transmute it, the violet ray will cleanse, purify, and literally it'll be sent off to the great central sun for repurposing. See it. See it. See the transformation. You're lighter. You float. You're at ease. You're passive. As you do this, you turn, you fold immediately into your heart mind. You immediately merge with your higher self. You are one. You bring heaven to earth. Heaven is a spirit. The body is earth. So you bring it all together. You're in balance. And as 
because you're in balance, you, you, you realize all of the energies that you are, all of the frequencies that you make up, all of the harmony. And you, you see and you merge and you move. Gold and white, pink light of prime source, creator God, just deep eternal love. The emerald green flaming healing light of Archangel Raphael. The purple transmitting flame. The violet ray, the white fire. The purple flame of Archangel Michael. These are merging and blending always. You, you, you have the clarity. You absorb, you mingle. You're part of this golden ocean. You're connected to the celestial energies, to the collective consciousness. You move gracefully, flowing. Arm in arm, hand in hand, we form our circle of light and we float up effortlessly. We're buoyant. We have no weight. We just float. As we're floating up, we call out and ask for all the light energy beings in all dimensions and all existences in all areas of the universes to join us in this meditation. And we lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so. And our light is brighter. We call in all of the archangels, the cherubim, the seraphim, the archetypes, all of the angels of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation. We lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so. And our light grows brighter. We call upon all of the Ascended Masters, Kuan Yin, Maitreya, Buddha, Gomorya, St. Germain, Sananda, Jesus, Lakshmi, Ganesh, Gaia, Abundantia, El Moria, all of the Ascended Masters who are of deep eternal love, from deep eternal love, to join us in this meditation and we lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so, and our light is brighter. We call upon all the inhabitants of inner earth and hollow earth, of deep eternal love, from deep eternal love, to join us in this meditation, and we lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so, and our light grows brighter. We call upon all of our loved ones who have passed over in this life and all lives that we've inhabited who are of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation. We lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so and our light is brighter. We call upon all of the benevolent galactics who are assisting in this human civilization, all inhabitants of this planet, and its great awakening, its, its awareness of ascension, and its freedom of bondage and slavery and manipulation, who are of deep eternal love from deep eternal love, to join us in this meditation. And we lovingly, graciously thank them for doing so. And our light is brighter. We call upon all of the light energy beings who have chosen to be in the forms on this planet of fairies, sprites, elves, of gnomes, trees, of mermaids, of whale, of dolphin. of the elements, earth, fire, water, air, of the 
Pegasus of the unicorns. All of deep eternal love from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation and we lovingly graciously thank them for doing so and our light is bright and it has eliminated the darkness of space brighter than all the suns and all the universes for we are the power of creation and love and peace and joy and harmony we look up and we see our meditative sphere which we have created through the collective consciousness through our intent holding all of our meditations in perpetual motion we feel the saturation of the love of the kindness of the care of the warmth of the compassion of the joy of the peace all of it we're bathed in it continuously we feel the rain coming down all over us penetrating our physical our etherical bodies penetrating our heaven our earth supercharging us of our clarity and our awareness of who and what we are we feel this from the top of our heads all the way to the bottoms of our feet we are the power of creation our intent our creation is peace joy love being in love in peace in joy happiness bliss prosperity abundance wealth wonderful health immortality all of this is because we are power we are the power of creation we are part of the collective consciousness of the universe the civilization of the universe we look down over the planet and we see all of our brothers and sisters we see all life we're connected they are part they are the power of creation we infuse them we send a burst of light we erect a crystalline light tower this crystalline light tower connects with all the towers that we've created in the etherics all over this planet in Gaia's crust in the atmosphere all harmonizing all connecting and all sending a surge of deep eternal love blanketing the planet inside and out in the atmosphere into space throughout the solar system throughout the galaxy into the universe and to forever this is the power of creation we call upon the collective consciousness to join us in this in this direction of energy in this effort of transmutation in this avenue of peace joy love prosperity togetherness compassion tranquility unselfishness no ego humbleness this is this is who we are this is the energy of our evolution this is our direction this is our transition into a higher frequency of sustaining energies to always be in this bliss this joy this happiness this peace we feel it we flow with it all of the civilization has it feels it flows with it but we are here to give it the boost through the towers in order to intensify the surge of understanding and comprehension and absorption that we are the power of creation that we enjoy each 
other's energy, that we are compassion, that we are love, that we are joy, that we are prosperity. And it flows through each and every one of us, everywhere. Not only here on this planet, but everywhere. Feel it. Celebrate it. Enjoy it. Embrace it. Be it. Join you in a meditation. I'll return to close this out.
higher frequencies. And the, the, the feeling from the physical is euphoric. So you're going to gravitate towards wanting, desiring to being in those frequencies continuously. This will happen if it isn't already starting to flow in. It will. As this does happen, you understand that it is it, it is a communication from the collective consciousness of the universe from you entering your true existence, which is to be in the enlightened state of being in love and peace and joy and happiness and abundance and wealth and prosperity and, and immortality. All of these things of uh, uh, what you are, you will vibrate with more and more and more and more and more and more. As you do this, the frequencies of this planet and of the civilization will continue to increase and it will continue to, continue to elevate. Now, some will know, uh, like all of you, others will kind of be medium. Others will be kind of not knowing what the feeling is. This is a, the, your understanding of your etherical God spark and your physical body merging is one. So you, as you understand, as I say, as you bring heaven to earth, heaven being the spirit, earth being the body, and you combine and you balance the, for better use words, yin and yang of your energy in a perfect harmony is where we are ascending into as a higher frequency. As we practice this, as we embrace it, we will become it more and more and more. Therefore, you will be in peace and harmony continuously. You will look at others in peace and harmony, respect, honor. You see, this is all a transition that we are experiencing. Where is it? It's now. It's, it's now. When? It's now. So as we collectively begin to awaken more and more and understand this, you will start to realize that everything that we have been concentrating on to uplift the civilization, to, to respect all life as the highest value in the universe, this is compiling and moving and stretching and elevating life, our existence. We are the power of creation. We have the fortunate com combination material to enter into the collective consciousness, this civilization of the universe. This is knowing. This is always knowing. It's being in, not going to be in, not one day be in, but being in the now, emulating this. So you will feel it this day, throughout the day. You will bring it with you because it is you. You are the power of creation. You are with everything, all life, all consciousness, everywhere. This is how you see that your power is so great. You can command, you can create in peace, in harmony, in joy in prosperity, in these energies, in these frequencies, you become it. So it, it is you, it's with you, it's awakening. So embrace it. We have a time for change call tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern. Many things to discuss, many, many, many things to discuss, to share. Um, 9 p.m. Eastern tonight. Again, we have a health 